Welcome to a new week of The Rundown. On this episode, sailors are encouraged to submit applications for tuition assistance, help with understanding your profile sheet, and CNO addresses the importance of Navy families. Sailors planning on taking college courses in 2018 can get a head start by applying for funding through tuition assistance, Navy College Program for Float College Education, and Distance Learning, or NC Pace DL. Applications for financial assistance are granted on a first-come, first-served basis, so it's important to beat the rush and get your application in now. Requests for funding must be submitted and approved by a Sailor's Command no later than 14 days before the start of the academic term. First-time TA or NC Pace DL users are required to complete online training that provides information on the benefits and limitations of each program. Training can be found on the Navy's College Program website under My Training. You can read more details on TA and NC Pace DL in the story on Navy.mil or by reading NavAdmin 243-17 on NPC. Advancement results were released and congratulations to all the sailors who advanced. You can get an in-depth review on how you tested by checking your profile sheet. Your profile sheet breaks down your score by sections and compares your score with others who took the same exam. It also provides your performance mark average, pass not advance points, and your time and rate. To help make sense of your score, read the story Understanding Your Profile Sheet on Navy.mil. The story looks at how the test is scored and how your profile sheet is designed to help improve your chances of advancing. Chief of Naval Operations Admiral John Richardson recently released the Navy's Family Framework, designed to inform sailors on the contribution of Navy families and how they are vital to mission success. The framework describes the role of families in the Navy, responsibility the Navy has towards families, and organizational goals to enhance mutual support. Some of those goals include improving Navy family support programs, improving Navy spouse training, and expanding education networks. You can read the framework by clicking the banner on Navy.mil. That's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople.fct at Navy.mil. For the Chief Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching.